Conversation and Pronunciation 26. Starting a business. Starting a business. I'm going to quit school. I don't recommend that. First, take a look at the title, Starting. Starting, Start. S-T-A-R-T, start. But when it has something following, this T sounds like R. So you say starting instead of starting. Say starting, starting a business. I'm going to quit school. I don't recommend that. I'm going to, um, I'm going to quit school. I'm going to quit school. I don't recommend that. So here, recommend that. Recommend that. So this th is a uh, voiced, and this d sound. They are quite similar, so you can cancel the d sound. Say recommend that. Recommend that. You don't have to say recommend that. Recommend that. I'm going to quit school. I don't recommend that. Don't worry, I'm going to start a business. What kind of business? Don't worry, I'm going to start a business. What kind of business? Don't worry, so do not pronounce the T's, just say don't worry. Don't worry, I'm going to start up. So this one, let's start it together. Start. This is start, but we have a following. So it's going to be starter, S-T-A-R-T, -T, like this. And then since T has an extra sound behind, this will sound like R. So you say starter, starter business, starter business. What kind of business? What kind of? So kind of has sounds like this kind of kind of what kind of business what kind of business don't worry i'm going to start a business what kind of business i'm going to make robot that does chores have you made the robot yet i'm going to make a robot that does chores have you made a robot yet i'm going to make a, here make a uh, would sound like may make make up make I'm going to make a robot that does does D O E S first of all this is do and then E S is not do's this this sounds like does does that does chores have you made a have you made a robot yet? Have you made, made up? So this one read together as made the, would sound like made up, made the, because this D and TH sound similar, made up. Have you made a robot yet? I'm going to make a robot that does chores. Have you made a robot yet? No, but I'm starting to. If you do manage to complete it, it would sell well. No, but I'm starting to. If you do manage to complete it, it will sell well. No, but um, I am. Or sound like um, I'm starting to. So here starting as T A R T I N G. So T after R sounds like R. So you can say starting, starting to. No, but I'm starting to. If you do manage to complete it, complete it. C-O-M-P-L-E-T-E-I-T. -E -E so complete is the ending sound. Come, complete, complete. And then you have it here. There's an I, another I, so this T flaps. Complete it, complete it, complete it. If you do manage to complete it, it would sell well. Would. So this one, would, L does make sound. Just say, 
would, should, could, and then even walk, talk. So do not pronounce L sound here. No, but I'm starting to. If you do manage to complete it, it would sell well. Yeah, that's why I'm going to quit school. You are right. Who needs school if you have a great idea? Yeah, that's why I'm going to quit school. You're right. Who needs school if you have a great idea? That's why I'm, um, again, I am. Would sound like, um, I'm going to. I'm going to. So going to, if you want, in spoken English, you can say gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna quit school. I'm going to quit school. I'm gonna quit school. You're right. Who needs school? If you have a great idea, who needs school? Who needs school? Needs school. So this S, which sounds like Z and S, they are quite similar. So you don't have to pronounce this. Say who needs who needs school? Who needs school? If you have a have a have a would sound like have a, have a great idea. Great idea. Great idea. Idea, I D E A. So this is D, but since it uh, comes from uh, comes between I and E, it sounds like I, idea, idea, idea. You're right. Who needs school if you have a great idea? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna I'm gonna quit school. You're right. Who needs school if you have a great idea? I'm just worried my parents won't understand. They love you. They'll understand. I'm just worried my parents won't understand. They love you. They'll understand. I'm um, again. I am. Can sound like I'm. Um, I'm just worried my parents. Worried my parents. So this read it together. Worried my. So let let this be worried my. Worried my. In order to pronounce this, this sound, we need to say do my. Worry do my. I'm just worried my parents won't understand. So one is the contract form of, I'm um, sorry, will not. Will not, or you can say won't, won't. I'm just worried my parents won't understand. They love you, they'll, they'll understand. So T-H-E-Y-L-L, -L, is contracted form of they will. So we say they will, but this one say they plus L, they'll, they'll, they'll understand. I'm just worried my parents won't understand. They love you, they'll understand. Okay, now let's listen to the whole conversation. I'm going to quit school. I don't recommend that. Don't worry, I'm going to start a business. What kind of business? I'm going to make robot that does chores. Have you made the robot yet? No, but I'm starting to. If you do manage to complete it, it would sell well. Yeah, that's why I'm going to quit school. You are right. Who needs school if you have a great idea? I'm just worried my parents won't understand. They love you. They'll understand.